to my general advice, I mean, if you, when you have to use a sunscreen, so you can use clothing to protect as much of your body, so you don't have to put sunscreen all over your body. Okay. So I think, you know, even when you have sunscreen on, it gives you good protection for maybe 45 minutes to an hour in, in the summer. It does not give you good protection for 10 hours if you're out there because there's a, I, I call it law of diminishing returns. You know, if the sunscreen blocks out 99% of your light, you're getting 1% coming through your skin. If I said to you, look, I'm going to give you 1% of a dollar, one cent, you say, that's really generous. If I give you 1% of a million dollars, you'll say, oh, I'm interested now. So the quantum of light changes. Okay? Right. And then I would always say to you, use a 50 plus sunscreen. So the laws regarding SPF varies from country to country. In this country, in order for the sunscreen to meet the 50 plus requirement, it has to have a minimum of a 17 or 18 rating for UVA protection. Anything lower than that, it doesn't necessarily have to have any UVA protection. And as you may remember, I was talking about UVA as a longer wavelength light hitting the pigment cells. So that's why I think having the 50 plus is important to protect against the pigment. 